The topic of applying ancient wisdom to modern finances explores how the financial practices and philosophies of ancient cultures can inform and guide modern financial decision-making. Ancient cultures developed complex financial systems and approaches to wealth management that were often grounded in moral and ethical principles. These principles can still be relevant and useful today, as individuals and societies strive to build healthy and sustainable financial practices. For example, many ancient cultures recognized the importance of balance and moderation in financial matters. They developed strategies for budgeting, saving, and investing that emphasized the importance of maintaining a sustainable financial lifestyle. They also recognized that financial success was not simply a matter of accumulating wealth, but of living a fulfilling and meaningful life. Other ancient cultures emphasized the importance of mindfulness and intentionality in financial decision-making. They recognized that our relationship with money can have a significant impact on our overall well-being, and developed practices for cultivating a healthy and balanced relationship with wealth. By studying and applying these ancient financial practices, we can gain a deeper understanding of how to build sustainable and fulfilling financial lives. We can also gain insights into the moral and ethical dimensions of financial decision-making, and learn how to align our financial practices with our values and goals. Ultimately, the goal of applying ancient wisdom to modern finances is to build a financial system that is sustainable, equitable, and aligned with our deepest values and aspirations. Welcome to our channel, where we share valuable insights and tips to help you achieve financial success. If you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future videos. By subscribing, you'll be joining a community of like-minded individuals who are committed to improving their financial well-being. So without further ado, let's dive into today's topic. Understanding the Role of Money in Ancient Cultures Understanding the role of money in ancient cultures is an important step in applying ancient wisdom to modern finances. Different ancient cultures had diverse views and practices related to money, wealth, and financial management, many of which are still relevant today. For example, in ancient Greece, wealth was often seen as a means of achieving personal excellence and contributing to society. The Greek philosopher Aristotle wrote extensively on the ethics of wealth and the importance of using wealth to promote the common good. Similarly, in ancient Rome, wealth was often associated with power and status, and wealthy individuals were expected to use their resources for the betterment of society. In contrast, many ancient Eastern cultures, such as India and China, emphasized the importance of balance and harmony in financial matters. They developed complex systems of budgeting and saving that emphasized the importance of living within one's means and avoiding excess. These systems were often grounded in moral and ethical principles, such as the principle of non-attachment and the importance of contributing to the well-being of others. Across cultures, ancient financial practices also often emphasized the importance of long-term thinking and planning. For example, the ancient Babylonians developed some of the earliest written records of financial transactions and developed complex systems of lending and debt management. They also recognized the importance of investing in agriculture and infrastructure as a means of ensuring long-term prosperity. By studying and learning from these diverse ancient financial practices, we can gain insights into the cultural, ethical, and moral dimensions of wealth and financial management. We can also develop new strategies and approaches for building sustainable, equitable, and fulfilling financial lives. Applying the concept of enough to personal finance. Applying the concept of enough to personal finance is a key principle that can help individuals build a sustainable and fulfilling financial life. The concept of enough suggests that instead of always striving for more wealth and possessions, we should focus on determining what is truly necessary and sufficient for our well-being and happiness. One way to apply the concept of enough to personal finance is to develop a budget that reflects our actual needs and goals, rather than our desires and aspirations. This involves taking an honest look at our spending habits and determining which expenses are truly necessary for our well-being and which are not. Another way to apply the concept of enough to personal finance is to develop a mindset of contentment and gratitude for what we already have. Instead of constantly striving for more, we can learn to appreciate and value the resources and possessions we already possess, and focus on using them in ways that align with our values and goals. The concept of enough also suggests that we should be mindful of our consumption patterns and their impact on the environment and society. 
By living within our means and being mindful of our impact on others, we can contribute to a more sustainable and equitable world. Overall, applying the concept of enough to personal finance can help us develop a more balanced and fulfilling relationship with money and possessions. It can help us build a financial life that is grounded in our values, contributes to our well-being, and aligns with our aspirations for a better world. Using mindfulness to build a healthy relationship with money. Using mindfulness to build a healthy relationship with money is a powerful strategy for promoting financial well-being and reducing financial stress. Mindfulness is the practice of paying attention to the present moment with openness and non-judgmental awareness. By applying mindfulness to our financial decision-making, we can develop a more conscious and intentional relationship with money. One way to use mindfulness to build a healthy relationship with money is to cultivate awareness of our financial habits and patterns. This involves taking a non-judgmental approach to observing our thoughts and behaviors around money, without trying to change or control them. Through this practice, we can develop a deeper understanding of our relationship with money and identify patterns that may be contributing to financial stress or anxiety. Another way to use mindfulness to build a healthy relationship with money is to cultivate a sense of gratitude and contentment for what we already have. By focusing on the present moment and appreciating the resources and possessions we already possess, we can reduce our tendency to compare ourselves to others and develop a more positive and fulfilling relationship with money. Mindfulness can also be used to reduce impulsive or compulsive spending behaviors. By pausing and taking a mindful breath before making a financial decision, we can create space for reflection and conscious choice. This can help us avoid making hasty or regrettable financial decisions and build greater self-awareness and self-control. Overall, using mindfulness to build a healthy relationship with money can help us develop greater financial resilience, reduce financial stress, and cultivate a sense of inner peace and well-being. By applying the principles of mindfulness to our financial lives, we can build a more conscious, intentional, and fulfilling relationship with money. Embracing a long-term perspective on investing. Embracing a long-term perspective on investing is a key principle for building sustainable wealth and achieving financial goals over time. Rather than focusing on short-term gains or reacting to market fluctuations, a long-term perspective involves making strategic investment decisions based on a well-defined financial plan. One way to embrace a long-term perspective on investing is to develop a clear understanding of our financial goals and risk tolerance. By identifying our goals and assessing our risk tolerance, we can create an investment plan that aligns with our long-term aspirations and takes into account our unique financial situation. Another way to embrace a long-term perspective on investing is to diversify our investments and build a portfolio that can withstand market volatility. This involves spreading our investments across different asset classes and sectors to minimize risk and maximize returns over time. A long-term perspective on investing also involves being patient and disciplined in our approach to investment. Rather than reacting to short-term market fluctuations, we can stay focused on our long-term goals and stick to our investment plan, even in the face of market turbulence. Finally, embracing a long-term perspective on investing involves staying informed about the broader economic trends and market conditions that may impact our investments over time. By staying informed and adjusting our investment plan as needed, we can stay on track toward our long-term financial goals. Overall, embracing a long-term perspective on investing can help us build sustainable wealth, achieve our financial goals, and weather market fluctuations with greater confidence and resilience. By staying focused on our long-term goals and building a disciplined, diversified investment plan, we can achieve greater financial security and peace of mind over time. Incorporating ancient wisdom into modern finances can have a profound impact on our financial well-being and overall quality of life. By drawing on the insights and practices of ancient cultures, we can cultivate greater awareness, balance, and harmony in our relationship with money and possessions. Whether we are seeking to build sustainable wealth, reduce financial stress, or cultivate a sense of purpose and meaning in our financial lives, ancient wisdom offers valuable guidance and inspiration for achieving our goals. By applying principles such as enough, mindfulness, and a long-term perspective to our financial decision-making, we can create a more intentional, fulfilling, and sustainable relationship with money. So, let us encourage ourselves to incorporate ancient wisdom into our financial lives by taking small steps towards implementing these principles. It can be as simple as developing a budget that reflects our actual needs, practicing gratitude for what we already have, 
or investing with a long-term perspective in mind. As we apply these principles and cultivate greater awareness and intentionality in our financial lives, we can experience greater financial security, peace of mind, and overall well-being. So, let's embrace the wisdom of the ancients and apply it to our modern finances to create a more fulfilling and sustainable financial life. If you found this discussion on applying ancient wisdom to modern finances valuable, I encourage you to subscribe to this channel for more insights and guidance on personal finance, investing, and wealth building. By subscribing, you'll receive notifications of our latest videos and be part of a community of like-minded individuals who are committed to achieving financial well-being and creating a fulfilling and sustainable financial life.